So today I'm going to touch on two um, control methods that are commonly used in generation resources such as uh, DERs for controlling voltage and frequency in this uh, power system. And those control systems or control methods are isochronous and droop control. In particular, I'm going to talk about droop speed control for um, regulating power system frequency. So in this example, we have a microgrid with two DER sources and some loads operating disconnected from the main grid. And this first DER is going to come online in isochronous control. And isochronous control is used if the generator is acting alone or if there are parallel units, it's the only one operating in that mode. So as these loads kick on, the, the generator will control to a nominal frequency while increasing its output. It's very similar to a uh, speed control on uh, or cruise control on your vehicle. The control system will increase fuel or decrease fuel to the system to maintain a speed set point. Now the second DER comes online. It's going to have to come online in droop control. Um, so in droop control, what happens is as the output of the generation system increases, there's a droop to the allowed power system frequency or the frequency output. So in this case, as this load kicks on, the frequency It'll arrest the frequency decline, but the generator frequency will be operating at 59.5, which is off nominal. You can't continue to operate in this uh, frequency. So what will happen is the generation control, frequency control set point will change. The droop will shift up so that while operating at this output, the generating system will be operating at a nominal value such as 60 hertz. And that's pretty much how droop works.